I used to get quite nervous before like I, I got on stage. Uh, not anymore, but like I, I used to have this um, every time before I, I went on stage before a gig, I, I had to brush my teeth to like feel at home again. I was talking to Dan Carter this morning and he said like, look, sometimes when I, like, I'm nervous and I, I pick up that rugby ball, the second I pick it up, I feel so comfortable. And I think it's the same with a, with a mixer because it's so, so like, that's the one part of the club that's like always the same. You touch it and you feel like completely at home and com completely comfortable again. I like, I like to do the, that the song do the talking rather than the envisioning of, of like whatever the crowd is going to dance to. Like writing songs, like I really try to like write about something that happened to me or like in, in his or her life and try and um, find a theme before we start. Nobody knows what they're doing really in the studio. Like you just, um, you mess around with the song, you mess around with samples and all of a sudden there's something, ah, that sounds right. And for your, like, for your mind to hear like a hook that you like, you have to be in the right mindset because um, if you're not, not feeling well or whatever, like you just skip through all the good options and you don't hear anything nice because you don't have the emotions to like kind of capture that. Rio, like, um, it's just a sample top line and all the writing was done like by, by this guy, Digital Farm Animals, for that hook, which like basically carries a song. I, I just tried to like make a DJ version out of it, really. I just released um, my, my last single with, um, with one of my favorite rappers of all time, uh, Lil Wayne. It's another artist called Bazi, who uh, was in the same song, um, who's gonna be like, in my mind, in my opinion, is gonna be the next Justin Timberlake in, in America. Um, so those, those are definitely two artists that I was super happy to work with. I feel really home in, in a city like Auckland. And it's so nearby all the other places. You could fly like to Queenstown in an hour and a half, uh, just got told, which is, yeah, amazing.